Hi, I am Smriti Ranjan Pareda. I am working with Mindfair Solutions. And uh, today's topic is SQL Sur Permission Extractor. So this is a free tool which will solve our purpose to migrating our SQL Server permissions from one server to another server. Basically, we do it manually or we have to write script to do that way. But this SQL Server Permission Extractor free, free tool will do this for for us okay easily so this is the overview of the tool so it will generate the scripts for us and also it will edit and save and execute the scripts also it will uh, include object level permissions for selected databases the selected database means above 2005 sql server 2005 okay so this is the system requirement for this tool like you can see that here windows xp minimum is service pack 3 then the supported sql server version is 2000 2005 then sql server 2012 so and this is me like uh, i have started my career with uh, mindfair and uh, working since last four years and my area of working varies from asp.net to wpf wcf and also MSBI like SSIS, SSRS and I am a Microsoft Certified Technology Specialist and also Microsoft Certified Professional. And this is my email ID and Skype. Uh, if any queries, you are free, feel free to contact me. So now let's go to that tool. Okay, before that, let's, so this is the tool I am going to give you a overview okay so this is the tool this is the idea tool okay now let's go to the tool so i have installed it now this is the source this is the target source is the source database and target is the ta target database so for our purpose i am selecting my local server that is on sql server 2012 okay so i am giving the permissions here Okay, so principal type is the by default server login and select a principal that is this type of logins are available there so I can select any. So I am selecting here this one okay and target server also I am selecting for the purpose my own server and giving the credentials. You can choose any other server so default database which is optional okay so and this is the new login name okay so like I am giving here okay and these are the options that is which databases you have to you want to give access so include database access it is uh, the database names present in my source database i am selecting here all then and it's also if you want to give object level permissions or schema ownership you can give it here so you you can specify here like if you want to keep the current password you want to give a new password okay so i am keeping the current password now let's turn create script so it will take some time to create the script uh, it will be very helpful uh, if if you are moving from one db to another db okay so now how fast you can see it is creating the script for us okay and also we don't have to manually execute the script we can save the script here and execute also on the target database okay so I am just clicking on the execute script button and it is creating the execute script, executing the script here, okay, just one second. Okay, script execution successfully, okay, 
so i am going to log in with this new login id okay so this is my server okay so the password is same as i have not changed the password but what happened login failed and the reason is okay so let's go to the reason here at the last you can found that the login new login is disabled by default is disabled so at the time of creation you can create it like enable or you can do it like this way i am going through the previous password and connecting it then security here is the logins and here is the nw login okay when i go to the properties here is the status and it is login disabled you can enable it here okay so now the login is enabled now just disconnect and reconnect it with okay with that same password i'm connecting again now you can see we have connected and also as we have mentioned all the databases so all the databases are accessible by me okay so that's it that's about the tool we have many other tools also from idera like permission reports confirm ddl and here are the more tools but these are like free uh, trial versions so this is the free versions so let's wind up this one okay so thanks for watching the video and here are the links uh, to mindfire solutions and you can uh, check this and you are always free to contact me on my mail or skype okay thanks all thanks a lot